children have a very important role to play in the body of Christ because we see in the scriptures that God many times raised up children in the generation for a very unique kind of task or role to play. And in that, we see that they were unique for the kingdom, like Esther, for this time you have been called to the kingdom. And there was to be the destruction of God's people totally across the face of the earth. And God chose an orphan girl of around 14 years old to be the instrumentation to bring change and to bring a positive conclusion to what it could have been a great problem. But they're the solution in the mind of the Lord Jesus Christ in his journey on on earth for those uh, 33 years or so because we see how he looked at that child when they had a, a 5,000 people who were very hungry and said there's a child here with uh, you know that, that one of the disciples said that has uh, some lunch with him, a few fish and uh, some bread and so Jesus says well well Bring that, bring that food from that child. So the child was for Jesus a solution. And if the church could wake up to the fact that children are solutions, uh, they could have a major role in the body of Christ today. That perhaps they're they're not seen that way, or very often they're seen more as maybe maybe challenge areas or problem areas. But if God, if we can see it God's way. I think this is uh, what would really make a difference. God wants to use them in prayer. Prayer is a very significant expression out of the hearts of children that make such a difference. I remember back in Jokowi 95, there in Seoul, Korea, there were 50 of these children. My son Daniel was one of them, a 14-year-old, and they were in prayer, and suddenly for one of these chi children, they started to draw a picture, and another uh, recognized it, who was the, one of the leaders in the group there, Esther Liniski was one person who was there, recognized that was the Ebola virus symbol, and so they started to pray for Ebola, and then we heard in the Uganda area and toward Ethiopia that there was that virus that was spreading and shortly after and this is recorded and you can see it recorded in the news media that there was the stopping of the Ebola virus right at that juncture so children who gathered together that was a movement of children beginning to to come together at that event that led to more and more uh, children in prayer and Esther Niski by the time the decade was over and the year 2000 was reporting that they were over a hundred thousand children that had become a part of this movement of prayer. We recognize that this is a unique moment for the uh, children in prayer that God is calling and making known to the body of Christ. So this is a very important role. I think they have a, a, a role also within their own families because the children uh, can be used by God and is being used by God in their own families with their own siblings. In our family, uh, almost all of our children were won to Christ by the other children in the family. And so uh, this is how they can be used also in sharing the gospel, sharing what's precious to them and, and passing on that to others close to them in the schools. So they have a major role to play. In the case of Uganda, when you had this AIDS virus that was enveloping the continent and the focus point was Uganda. And back in 1993, they estimated 33% of the pregnant women had the AIDS virus and so the next generation was was greatly affected by that and to be greatly affected but then all of a sudden they started to say what can we do to bring change and uh, to 500 schools a seminar was held to talk about worldview where do we come from where are we and where are we going and in the process of putting that into the context of the Word of God there was behavioral change of those students as they themselves changed their sexual behavior, but also influenced others. And all of a sudden, in 10 years, you see the reduction from that 93%, uh, 33%, one out of every three, down to less than 10% to the year 2003. So you see that children can play a role in many different areas within the church. And many times we think of them just as those that we minister to, but that we need to learn and see how we can have ministry from those children because God wants to use them as he, as he has done over uh, the years that are recorded in Scripture.